Hello, Hank Kuiper here from Boats on Wheels. Today I'd like to introduce you to Hermione, a Jano Sun 2000. These little Sun 2000s have a very fine entry point leading back to a much wider stern, so a very contemporary hull shape. And you can see they sit really low on their trailer. That means they're really easy to get in and out of the water. And when you do get them out of the water, you can pretty much go anywhere with them. Hermione dates from 2007. And as you can see, her top sides are immaculate. She's never been banged by the looks of things. So a very, very clean boat. Such a wide stern doesn't just provide stability, but also a huge cockpit to move around in. Hermione has a decent Z Spars mast, which has its own raising kit and lowering kit, allowing short handed raising or lowering of the mast. As with many boats, do we get through here on boats on wheels? We've given this one some brand new stainless steel standing rigging as well. Hermione has been fitted with a lazy bag lazy jack system, which makes it really easy to stow away that mainsail, especially if you're short-handed or single-handed. Hermione has plenty of sail trim opportunities, decent kicker, and you could create a little bit of mast bend as well with this backstay tensioner. One of the benefits of these little Sun 2000s is that the keel can be pulled up from in the cockpit. Very light, very simple mechanism, gets the keel up in no time. But when you want to drop it, it gives you 1.6 meters of draft. So that's plenty of pointing ability. On the same vein, the rudder can be pulled up Hermione has a four horsepower, four stroke Mariner engine, which has just been serviced by us. This little engine also helps to charge the battery when it's fired up and it's got plenty of fuel for those longer trips, giving you a much greater range. To help with navigation and sailing, there's both a wind meter and depth and log out in the cockpit. The depth and log currently don't work, so we expect to replace that unit with a brand new one. And also what you have down here is a compass. And on the hatch, there's also a solar cell to charge that battery a little bit further. Hermione can be sailed with a hatch open, give some protection for the wind and rain, and still room for the lines to go around. One of the benefits of these little Sun 2000s is that the hatch is completely removable. So you can stand down below in some safety and comfort and even get to some of the lines on the mast. Down below, Hermione has plenty of space for both sleeping and cooking. These little Sun 2000s come with huge rear bunks which go right underneath the cockpit and down there you might just spot that's where the water bag is kept as well. All of the bunks come with stowage underneath them and you've got mm. more stowage under the sink and the stove as well. Just above the port side bunk, there's a chart plotter with a VHF radio and above it control panel as well as a battery meter. And mine comes with a handy removable cabin table, which can also be used up in the cockpit for drinks after a day sailing. And as with most boats from Boats on Wheels, this little boat comes with its own trailer. It's a single axle Bramber trailer. Capacity is 1.8 tonnes. 
dates back to 2007, same age as the boat, comes with a spare wheel and a flushing kit which allows us to flush out the trailer after use in salt water. The trailer's been given a service by us to make sure that she's safe to go on the road so she has new bearings and she's good to go. So I hope you enjoyed our little tour of Hermione. If you enjoyed it then please hit the like button. If you'd like to know more about Hermione then why not get in touch with us through BoatsOnWheels.com. Thank you.